Hello everybody, welcome back to another guide. Um, I am here today because I just started, I just created this new template for my live stream. I'm gonna be live streaming some uh, old Atari games and trying to get some retro achievements done. So if you wanna come check me out on Twitch, that'd be great, it's BroccoliRob74. But I'll also be uploading these guides to YouTube so you can always go and review them later if you want. Um, I'm going through and was playing a little bit of karate. I'm testing out this new format that I have up for this scene on OBS. Um, it kind of updates it, retro achievements as I go, um, puts in all the information, the ratios, the achievements, the completions, stuff like that. Um, what I'm, the achievements I'm focusing on and everything. So today I'm just doing a quick run through of karate. Karate is one of the easier games on retro achievements. The ratio is only 1% or 1.0. Uh, which means it's very easy to get and i'll show you why in a second uh this game was made back in 1982 by ultra vision it's uh for the 2600 and it's pretty straightforward <laughs> you're just a guy trying to kick another guy and you get points you go through different levels uh your belt uh goes up in color every time that you go to a different level um, and then when you get to the end which is about five boards you get the um the end of the championship and you win the idea here is that like a lot of these achievements there was one that was just literally just standing still and doing nothing um you have to do that through five different ways and i didn't want to do that on this guide you can just sit there and do that it's basically start you start up a game and to do that you're going to hit the um start button let me get that going here in a second uh you're going to hit the select button and select you get two modes you got type one and type or mode one and mode two mode two is two player mode one is one player um you're going to select that and then it's timer is going to start and basically you're just not going to move you're going to sit here like this through five different um belt changes you're going to see my belt I, i'm actually the purple guy and you're going to go through the uh, changes belt changes at the end of the two minutes and then it'll go in another two minute round and it'll be like a red belt a yellow belt green belt and then you know the black belt so and then once you get the black belt finished then that's when you get the achievement after about eight minutes so with that being said the, the other achievements that i've already gotten are mostly just point related achievements and i'm going to show you how to get those pretty easily um, and we can wrap up maybe the rest of these achievements and get them mastered but i'm going to start a new game here and then basically what you're the whole idea of this game is to beat your opponent obviously but the way we're going to do that is sorry i'm trying to get this moving here okay um we're just going to hold left and literally just hold the a button um and that's going to get you the majority of the achievements because it, it'll literally just sit there and do this the whole time and he'll continuously walk into you if you run into the bottom of the left hand of the screen it'll just reset you back to the middle again but you don't even really have to do much you just sit here and just hold left and the button down um, you can see I'm just kicking non-stop kicking them in the face and your score will go up uh, it's pretty easy <laughs> nothing really to this game uh, if you play legit and try to actually like punch and kick them it, there's just no I don't see any format of how to do that consistently um, and win. So this this is found to be the easiest way to get all these achievements. And like I said, I'm just playing this game and getting these achievements knocked out more or less to show my new uh, setup for my stream. And uh, and I hope you guys like it. I, it's, it's to test it too. I mean, basically anytime I get an achievement, there's gonna be uh, the achievement will pop up after about 20 or 30 seconds at the bottom of the screen. So easy win there. Just again, hold down left and the A button. If you go to the bottom of the screen, I think it makes it a little bit easier. Yeah, like go all the way to the bottom. And that way he'll just keep walking into you. I don't even think I have to move here at all. I can just sit here and just keep walking into me eventually uh take them down i think there's one last achievement 
complete the leg is by kicking to the face. Um, so hopefully we'll get that here soon. I'll just keep kicking him in the face. This will just about net you all the achievements by doing this, except for the the one where you have to stare. That's obviously kind of annoying, but you know, it works because you can just stand there and you automatically win. <laughs> If I can get the uh, 900 here, I think you have to get 900 before you can get the knockout. I have to go down to the bottom a little bit faster next time. Go straight down. And we got sweep the leg there. So that's easy. Should update here in a second. So with the what's this one we got sweep the leg it should see how long uh this retro achievements update comes i'm down not down far enough or apologize if the audio is loud on these old atari games i've turned it way 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 down so you can barely hear the um Atari sounds because some of them can be loud and obnoxious. So there are my achievements upgraded and my next focusing one it says win a match uh, by knockout 900 points. So yeah, we'll have to work on that one to get go down to the bottom, hold down A, so we'll get 900. Probably got to do it on the white um, belt, so it might be easier to do that. I think these guys even get more aggressive. So let's go ahead and let's restart here and go down and try to get this on the white belt here. Just hold it down. Hopefully we have enough time to get it done. This is just based on how fast he walks into my foot. Face to foot. This is definitely not foot to face because he's walking right into it. Thumb's actually getting tired. <laughs> Holding down the button for this long. I don't even know if we're going to hit 900 here. It's going to be close. There we go. Took him out with 900. AO. So I'll update in a second and then we'll see what else we got to do here. I don't know what that last one is. Hope it's not a now oh, here's a say survive an entire math match without it I don't know I can't read that let me let me uh, double check that but have an entire match.
at this. I'm gonna see what this uh, achievement is here real quick. So I'm gonna pause it. See what this uh, last one is, so we can get knocked out and get the master done, and I can post the video for you. It says survive an entire match without being hit once. Um, so yeah, we're gonna need to reset that and try to do that on match is just the two minutes so if we survive that without being hit that's that's actually not that i would think it would be easy but i feel like that would be pretty hard to do we'll see what we can do here i think try to not get hit here so far so good if he doesn't hit us, we're good. Forty seconds left. Hopefully, we'll get this ironed out. Like I said, this game is more of a test for me for the scene, and uh, I will be doing like legit guides on other stuff. And if there's an achievement that's really hard and takes a long time, I'll do just a completely separate guide for just that specific achievement. So there we go. We got the last achievement there. You just kind of going on in the right, right hand corner and just kind of hold down left and, uh, the, the a button and in that's, you're good to go. So there it is fully mastered. Um, I didn't see the time there was fully mastered in, but, uh, you know, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did give me a like and a subscribe and I'll be doing more videos like this and, or let me know what game you think I should do on here. That'd be great. And I will see you soon. Bye.